Jerkali artisans looking to break into the competitive heavy machinery production space are calling for support to mass produce to effectively compete with established entities. The artisans say despite making quality products, they are outsmarted by mass production by established firms. This is a mechanical brick pressing machine. Its results are wholly pressed brick that can be used in building structures. But the makers of such machines say they are undervalued, mainly by potential customers who prefer products from established farms. At least if the government, uh, if those agencies uh, could be able to come through uh, and give us a good funding that can enable us uh, to be able to do batch production, that would be a very good step to start with. Artisans looking to break into the formal sector are creative and come up with quality products that are fairly priced but face the challenge of uptake of their innovations. We have varieties from the uh, shamba, how you get the primat and you uh, separate from the kennels. We have a machine that can do that. We also have a machine that can roast. Yeah? And from that, we have the process where you go and grind. We also have a machine for that. The informal sector employs 15 million people in Kenya, doing jobs such as welding, plumbing, electrical and masonry, among others. But Chomba says they still light at the end of the tunnel, especially with goodwill from value chain players and those in positions of authority. These, uh, uh, let's take for example Mseya, uh, the one that has uh, facilitated this uh, forum. If they are able to come up with uh, more more of these forums that where we do the, we, we get to do the exposure of what we are selling, what we are producing, then uh, I think that one will create a good market. Currently, the government through agencies such as the Micro Small Enterprises Authority, MSEA, has rolled out initiatives to empower and support those in the Jokali sector with training and funding. Alan Alko, Lunchtime News.